News at 5 o'clock. After nine hours, a jury cannot reach a verdict in the trial of County Commissioner John Wiley Price. Meanwhile, an undercover policeman killed during a by-bust operation was apparently shot by fellow police officers. And parents and school officials want to know how to protect young children after two recent abductions. A busy day of news, and it's all next here on Channel 8. Working in the spirit of Texas, WFAA-TV. News 8 presents Chip Moody, Lisa McCree, Troy Dungan, and Dale Hansen. This is News 8 at 5. I think a clear message has been sent from the, this community. Uh, Anglos, African Americans, Mexican Americans, a jury of my peers have said, hey, for the most part, they feel like I'm not guilty. One of those things that, uh, that uh, has a potential of occurring anytime and everything went wrong and it, and it occurred last night. Two big stories top our news this evening. The trial of Dallas County Commissioner John Wiley Price ends in a hung jury. And some startling, tragic new information on in the death of a Dallas undercover narcotics officer. We begin with the death of Dallas Police Officer Lawrence Bromley, a member of the department's narcotics unit. Channel 8's Bill Brown has been following the story today. He joins us now with the latest. Bill? Lisa, this is really tragedy compounded by tragedy, a bad situation. Not only do we have a Dallas police officer killed in the line of duty, but now we learn that he was shot by his own men as a drug bust went wrong. It was what police call an undercover by bust, in which officers are